guys, so today is the day that I leave for Germany. Um, I'm really excited. I'm still kind of packing, but I have... That's all my things over there, so... Um, I'm really excited. I'm kind of nervous. I just did my nails last night. Um, I'm gonna go get my eyebrows done in about, like, five minutes, so... Gonna be polished, gonna be nice. I bought some last minute makeup. And like, it's kind of surreal that it's actually happening. Wait till you guys see what I'm gonna wear to the airport. Oh my God, it's the best thing. Cause it's Halloween, okay? So I figured, oh, I can't fly to a country on Halloween without respecting the fact that it's Halloween. So, yeah. <laughs> Um, I'm, I'm crazy excited, I'm super nervous, but um, I'll do some check-ins throughout the day, all right? So it's 7.32 right now, and I'm sitting here at my computer finishing up some last minute work for school and sending out emails to respective parties. I'm getting really nervous. I, I, kinda, I kinda can't believe it's happening. <laughs> um, and I also got my room listing. So like they put up a room list of who I'm gonna be with and um, what room I'm in, and apparently everyone was messaging me like, you're in one of the nicest rooms, you're in one of the nicest rooms, called like the white, the white room. I, I don't know what it is, I'll probably end up posting images. It's supposedly really, really nice, and I'm really, really excited to stay in a really nice room. I'm gonna be staying in that room um, with my sister, sure, um, well, my sister in game, and like it's, uh, it's happening guys, we are finally here. We've been talking about it for so long. My bags are packed, they're in the car. I only have to pack my backpack. And it's kind of like... Wow. It's time. So yeah, my hair is, is garbage right now. <laughs> I probably should have gotten my bangs cut before I left, but uh, I couldn't be bothered, so nah. But I'm gonna wash my hair, take a shower, Fish packing and uh, head out. So, yeah, see you soon. like they made me check in my carry-on because I didn't know that Norwegian like you know your personal bag like your backpack and your carry-on luggage they count it together so that's a good tip for anybody who didn't know that uh, I didn't so my carry-on is what had all my costumes in it so because I was depending I was like oh I you know at least I won't lose my carry-on if I had because if I lose my check-in I lose like my daily clothes some candy I brought but I'm I was really nervous I have never been more apprehensive to hand over my bag because it's like if I lose that bag I'm basically gonna have a really bad farewell manner but they they assured me it's gonna get to Berlin just fine so I'm just gonna relax drink a little bit eat a little bit of food get on my flight and clock out so. Oh, there we go. Actually, you might have to do it this way. 
Can you see? Through the plant. There we go. But wow. um, he plays Edison, or played Edison at College of Wizardry 12, so he was um, my good friend that I held onto and cried while I got sorted into Faust. It was very, it was very sad. <laughs> But he's playing my uncle at Fairweather Manor. What's your character's name? Uh, Arthur Fitzgerald. Arthur Fitzgerald. So he is the brother to my dad, Thomas Fitzgerald. And there are, he is in... He hangs out with too many artists. <laughs> so we're really excited. We're waiting on um, Alyssa, who is playing Amanda F um, Fairweather, who is getting married. She's the bride. So I'm sure we'll do another one once we get in the car to say hi to everybody. But we're going to be there soon, and we're so excited. Ah, ah, okay, bye. So we're currently driving through uh, Germany right now. We have a four hour drive till we get to the castle in Poland. And we have the bride who's the driver. And you can't, yeah, she that's her. I'm not gonna make her turn around because she's driving. But my camera wants to focus. There we go. That's her right there. But, and that's Richard right there. <laughs> so we're, uh, on our way and I guess I'll check in when we're a little bit closer. Wow. 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 Oh, hello. <laughs> so that's the kind of like the geographic center. Yeah. I had it like a castle, so I always kind of go back to there and then I kind of come up. Okay. Holy, holy smokes! I'm gonna get so lost. Oh my god, I'm gonna get so lost. Oh my gosh, this place is amazing. I'm so disoriented already. I mean, that there were no bombs actually bigger because there was an entire floor, like the entire wing here was in the, right, in the basement floor. It was servants area. Wow. Why they kind of narrowed it down so we don't have the entire fucking thing because getting lost and there was another thing. Yeah. I believe that. No, wait. What? Yeah, but, but this room. Yeah, this room. So it is um, like two something on Thursday. I have come in. I have gotten settled. Um, we did all the training and workshops today, which was really fun. Um, we did, you know, practice how to dance. We kind of learned about, you know, who's conservative and who's not conservative, things like that to create character play. And guys, I have to show you my room. So we're in what's called the white room. And it is just... Oh, by the way, that's Constance. That's my sister. That's played by Kat. So that's... She's doing stuff for real world. But this is our room. Guys. Oh, so in, in that row, wardrobe right there, that's where I put all my costumes. So... If I open this... 
on this side it has like my day dresses and we have a secret white stash and then like some of my accessories and then on this side is like my hats and um my wigs and stuff but and my shoes my shoes are down there but you can't see them and then we have like um an off game closet which is that one right next to the fireplace and then we have this is uh, constance's closet and then this is our like fancy dress closet so we have um here are all my gowns on the side so that's my bridesmaid's gown that's the gown from the video which is going to be worn on friday night and then this is my ball gown that i um designed but guys this room is everything it's so huge like I guess you can hear my voice echo off the walls, so. And then we have, oh, I'll show you the bathroom. So this is the door to the bathroom. And, oh, I turned the lights off. I'll uh, turn them on, but. Okay, so this is the bathroom. Now, this is our shower, and then we have two sinks. And then get ready for this. That is our bathtub. Guys. Look how deep it has freaking steps like a pool. That's how deep it is. Like it's so deep. Um, so we're getting we're gonna ask staff if we can actually use it because like it has this overhead shower thing, and it is like yeah, it's my god, it's incredible. It's so cool. And then uh, we actually have a second toilet room with another sink in it, which is right here. And we put like our makeup and stuff down there so we can kind of hide it. That's the toilet. So, it's a big fucking room. And it's just me and um, and Kat in it. So, it's pretty cool. Um, I'll show you like our beds. Oh, let me turn off the light. But, yeah, let me show you the beds. Kind of dark over there. You also can't see, but like this view goes directly outside the front of the mansion. So those colored lights, that's the huge fountain and like water that's out there, but you can't see it. Um, and these are our beds. So we can either, like if we wanted to, we're, we're fine with the beds kind of touching like this, but if you wanted to, like if you were playing with somebody you really didn't know and you didn't feel comfortable with that, you could just move it and move that. And that's the heater right there. And there's another chandelier, but um, yeah. So, and these are all my letters. So these are the uh, the the actual letters from Jean Pierre. We actually had them printed out, and they look freaking awesome. And then these are like other letters from my father. That was young, and um, this is my legendary Irish folk tales, fairy Irish fairy and folk tales. So it's precariously out here because you know if a servant was a little bit too handsy, wanted to grab it. Oh, I'm really sorry about my mouth. I bought a ton of American candies because it was just Halloween for all the Europeans and like we are doing like a candy trade-off so I'm getting all this Danish and Swedish candy in exchange for American and I was having a, a blue ring pop so my, my mouth is like it's blue um, but so we're having the hen party in here uh, and they came to me and they were like oh Raquel are you cool with having this room and I was like yeah, they're like it's one of the nicest places to stay in the castle. And I'm like, yeah. And they're like, oh, but you're gonna have to have the hen party in it. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> they're like, oh, and Kat, who plays your sister, is gonna be in it. And I was like, fuck yeah. I was like, we were already planning to see you together anyway, so what does it matter? It's fine. Um, so they were like, oh, okay then. Oh, focus camera. And they were like, oh, okay then. I guess it works out. I'm like, yes, yes it does. So. I'm, uh, I'm going to sleep, uh, Kat's gonna help me braid my hair so that I can wear my wig uh, to sleep. Cause I'm that diverted. Cause we're basically, I'm in my pajamas for what I'm going to wear and I have this ridiculous train. So this is what I'm gonna wake up in tomorrow. And then these are all my undergarments on the windowsill. So this is everything that I wear underneath my outfits. So I have my chemise, I have my open crotch bloomers, and then I put on the corset. And then I put on um, my corset cover, and then I put on my hip pads, and then I have an overskirt. So that's just what goes over, under the dress, not even the overdress. So I think it's gonna be great. I'm gonna be pretty warm. And yeah, so this is Thursday. I don't know if I'm gonna do check-ins every night, simply for the fact that 
Um, I'm in an in-game room, and so things are gonna be happening. I'm gonna be out and about, and probably by the time I go to sleep, I'm gonna be fucking exhausted. So probably this is the last time I'll see you till the end of the LARP, but we'll see. And yeah, so I guess I'll see you soon, guys.